All right, everybody, we're hopping into stage five of the eighth anniversary battle event where we can get unique skill orbs for all of the characters who made their debuts in the anniversary. So next up, we have the fifth anniversary, which was Blue Vegito and Blue Gogeta. This is where our equipments are going to start making a huge impact on these characters because they just easy aid. You guys know I think these are some of the best units in the game right now, and these equips are just going to make them a lot better. Now, starting with stage four, they started adding a little bit of extra info here for us. Um, so let's go ahead ahead and look at that uh, they started adding these little notes about these guys and the event tips be sure you check out this information there's always a lot of good stuff in here to read so if you're ever having trouble with an event hop in and see if they gave you any tips in here sometimes they'll give you a little bit so stunning effects are effective against Vegito while super attack ceiling effects worked well on Gogeta in phase 3 the opponent will transform into Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan, a form even more powerful than Super Saiyan God. Alright, so looks like they're telling you, stun Vegito and seal Gogeta. So if you're having trouble with this stage, make use of these effects on these guys, and, uh, you know, you can get a lot of you, you know, you can get some value out of that. Let's go ahead and take a look at the missions that we need to complete before we hop into team building. Okay, so this is stage 5. We just need to clear stage 5, that'll give us the 8 stones and, uh, defense bronze equips for these guys. Clear stage 5 without using support items will give us the silver, which is a level 6 crit and level 400 defense, or plus 400 defense, and then clear stage 5 using all 5 types. Cool, so there's no um, turn restriction on this one. Stage 4, we did have a turn restriction. Looks like this one is a little bit faster here, so, uh, or I'm sorry, not faster, it's just a little bit more lenient, so we just need to bring the 5 super types in here, well, not super types, but 5 character types. It's going to be AGL, Tech, Int, Physical, and STR. You need to have one of each of those typings on your team in order to complete it um, I think for this event what we're going to do is bring Piccolo Jr's team just for funsies uh, Piccolo Jr leads gifted warriors terrifying conquerors or giant form let's go ahead and grab him I uh, haven't used this team in a while uh, just because we haven't really gotten any terrifying conquerors or like giant form buffs or anything recently so you know it, it's it's been a little bit since I've used it but uh, it should be it should be good to go for this event uh, what's the other one gifted warriors excuse me uh, I just, oh, oh, I didn't grab it. Let's see, Gifted Warriors. There we go. I'm trying to use just a bunch of different teams in this event that maybe I haven't used in a while. Um, what are the typings? Let me, let me take a sneak peek here. Let me, let me cheat a little bit. <laughs> Let's take a look. All right, so Vegito is AGL and Physical and Tech. And then Gogeta, I, I assume this is two different stages. Is this one of the ones that you have the option to choose? Um, I don't, I don't know which one we'll do. We'll, we'll probably do Vegito. They said Vegito could be stunned, so we'll probably do the Vegito fight, so. Um, AGL, Physical, and Tech. Yeah, this is a, this is a good one for this guy. Uh, let's see. What units do we want to bring? Um, this is always the fun part, right? The, the team building. <laughs> uh, how hard do these guys hit? Like, are they, are they starting to be, like, red zone level? Like, how hard are you hitting? 220k... 30% buff, 1.1, yeah, th these guys are starting to be red zone levels, so we gotta be a bit more cautious with our team building here. L give me a second, I'll get a team built, and we'll come back in. Alright, here we go, this is the team we're going to be rocking with. Um, the only character I'm going to be super concerned about, maybe, is this guy in the final phase against Vegito, and I did notice over here, let me show you real quick, um, you know, we can stun in the first two phases, you can see he's not immune to it here or here, that's this guy is not immune, and then this guy is not immune, but he is immune in the final phase, but, uh, we're gonna have, you know, we're gonna have Big Daddy there. <laughs> we're gonna have Big Daddy ready to go in this fight, so, not, not too worried about it. Let's go ahead and hop in. Ooh, fun KO screen. Uh, we can go ahead and switch back over to the in-game music as well, so let's do that. All right, here we go. Uh, pretty good opening rotations as well, nice. Oh, uh, do we have intros on? No, okay, good. <laughs> I say we we're about to watch a movie if we had intros on. Um, I'll leave it just like this. This is perfect, pretty much. Uh, let's do this. Start getting Golden Frieza built up. Uh, this guy will be fine at the end. We're probably going to stun him with him. So, uh, you know, in the junior, I think he should be returning for the worldwide celebration here in about a month. Well, at the end of the month, actually. He should be returning. I don't know if he'll be on the part one banners or the part two, um, but whichever banner he is on, I mean, listen, he's a good pickup. Whether you get him with coins or um, whatever, you know, if you can put him on a team, that dude just shreds. So, that is a that is a great unit to pick up. This should build up Golden Freeze's attack, assuming he doesn't dodge any of these. He needs to get hit like five times, I think, to build up his extra attack and his passive. 
uh, which is fine, but then he needs to super attack five times to build up his extra defense. So if he wants to give us triple super, he can double super for sure, but if he wants to triple super on this first turn, that would be really helpful for us in getting his defense built up. Uh, because by the time we get to that final fight, yeah, okay, well, we got the third attack, but we failed the 50% uh, the roll. There's the extra key in attack that he gets for getting hit five times. Uh, Orange Piccolo should get us out of this phase. I don't even think Metal Cooler is going to get an attack here. All right. Pretty good. And there's the stun. I think we should be able to get to the um, Tech Vegito phase before um, AGL Frieza. Honestly, we should probably be able to get there on turn three. So AGL Frieza would still have his 70% damage reduction. So... Pretty good. Okay, let's leave it just like this. We should be fine. Um, we'll do that. Grab that right there. And again, I think we're just going to walk out of here pretty quickly um, on this turn. I I think there's a decent chance that we uh, one-turn this guy. We'll see. How much HP does he have? He has 16,500,000 defense. Not too bad. Um, I didn't see a second fight. So is this just going to be we fight him and then we go into Gogeta? Is that what this is going to be? That must be what this one is. I, I wasn't paying attention whenever we hopped in. <laughs> I was looking at something else. But, uh... I didn't see a path. I think some of these have paths, and you can choose which fight you want to do. So, um... For those, I don't I don't know which one we'll do. We'll make the decision on the fly, depending on the team build that we have. Nice. Or, in, or Piccolo Jr. here going crazy. If he gets a crit, um... I don't remember how much crit is in mine. Maybe, like, 14 or something. One more? Nice. Okay, he's out of here. <laughs> yeah, we're... <laughs> Or, uh, Piccolo Jr. is just too good. <laughs> yeah, sorry, buddy. Alright. <laughs> Vegito, Vegito is not built like that, you know? He, he's, I'm sure for some of you, you're hopping in here and you're like, bruh, what am I supposed to do? I don't have Piccolo Jr. just one-shotting this guy. And it's like, well, sorry. <laughs> the nice thing, right? Oh, this one. We need to bring one of each typing. And I don't, did we do that? Oh, we don't have an STR unit. Okay, so I'm gonna have to do this fight again. No, we do have an STR unit. Hang on. AGL, Tech, STR, Int, Physical. Oh, look at that. We did it. <laughs> I totally, whenever I was team building, I totally forgot about that secondary requirement. <laughs> Completely forgot about that I needed all five types on this team. So, uh, luckily we're good. <laughs> uh, it's all good, you know. But, uh, you know, I'm sure some of you guys, you might be struggling with some of these fights because they start getting to red zone level about here. Uh, you know, this is where they start getting to kind of a difficult level. You know, they're doing a 1 million damage on their super attacks or more. So you, you might start after bringing real teams in this fight. Luckily, it looks like they're countdown bosses. I don't know how much this is actually going to do. Let's see. Okay, a little bit of damage to Frieza there, but he has typed his advantage. And uh, I'm expecting that Majunior here is just going to... Uh, I think he's going to do like two super attacks and completely wipe this guy. So we'll, we will see, though. So there's one. Here comes number two. We could have number three coming in. We could have number four coming in. <laughs> we, we will see. This guy is so fun. One more? Ah. That's okay. <laughs> um, This guy should have his guard because we have physical Piccolo on the team. Alright, cool. Alright, here we go. Can't even use the active skill. <laughs> uh, we'll do this. STR Piccolo should be fine in slot one. We'll give all this physical key to Metal Cooler, and let's get out of this first fight against Vegito. I'm finally finished with dinner, by the way. For anybody keeping track of the dinner saga, we are done with dinner. <laughs> now I gotta drink some water, because I haven't had any in like an hour. <laughs> oh, nice. The, uh, the third stage finished processing as well. Let's go ahead and get that published. Um, but yeah, let me know if you guys are having trouble with this stage or not. So far, it seems pretty simple. Okay, it is. It is. We go from this one to that one, so. Uh, let's see what Gogeta's got in terms of his stats. Remember that you can seal Gogeta in the first two phases. It's just like Gogeta. Or, it's just like Vegito. Um, looks like his stats are pretty similar. So, that, if you got past the first phase, you should be able to get through this one as well. Yeah. It, this doesn't look too bad. He's doing about the same things this guy was. So if you if you get through the first phase, you should be able to get through this guy as well. So it should be no issue there. Again, that's just the uh, Dokkan info site. That's where I have that all pulled up. The nice thing too is we get to reset Golden Freeze's damage reduction. Um, so he's at a fresh 90% here. We know where the super attack is thanks to Physical Piccolo. 
all is well in this event at the moment. Yeah, go ahead and super this guy, buddy. <laughs> Uh, Piccolo Jr. is going to be a little bit less effective in this fight just because he doesn't have type advantage in the final phase, but it, it really doesn't matter. Uh, <laughs> you know, Piccolo Jr. is just simply that guy. <laughs> if you guys have never used Orange Piccolo, you you are in for a treat. Uh, oh no, I can't. Let's do this. There we go, stage two. <laughs> I got to link all these other videos in the videos. This is like the most annoying part about posting videos is I can't just like hit you know, reuse cards or, like, evenly space most recent videos. I have to go in here and, like, manually place all these other videos. I don't even know if anybody clicks on these links that I put in the top right. I usually don't put much effort into them either. Like, some people, sometimes I'll put, like, a funny name in there, like, hot singles in your area. I, don't know. I just, I get a joke out of that, right? It, like, pops up in the top right of your screen, so... <laughs> I don't know, maybe nobody thinks that's funny, but sometimes I do it just in the hopes that somebody sees it. Because I, I don't know if anybody actually clicks on those. I'm, I'm sure, like, YouTube has, like, a metric somewhere where I could, like, track and see if people are clicking on those, um, links. But I, I don't know offhand if they are. Alright, our fuse power is greatly greater, or whatever he just said. Yay. <laughs> Proud of you, buddy. Alright, let's go to make this live. You guys are getting, you know, public insight right now. We're, we're pushing stage three lives, so... You know, if you want an exact timestamp for when I did that, go check Twitter or my uh, my YouTube channel. That's that's where we're at in the recording process. So uh, let's do. Um, I kind of like this. Let's let's do this. Let's grab those orbs, and then we can grab all of these eight. Uh, do we want to do this? Let's do that. Let's not be greedy. Let's save the AGL orbs for next turn. Let's see, we can start editing stage four now. Stage four is uploaded. See, we're currently doing stage five. <laughs> Let's copy that into Twitter. I don't. Uh, let me know if you guys follow me on Twitter or not. I know not many of you do, but you know, if, it, it's always in the description. I mean, I post my video links there, so if you're ever wondering and you know, share stuff related to Dragon Ball content, sports, and stuff like that. So, I don't know. You you don't have to follow me. I'm definitely like a low tier follow on Twitter, but uh, you know, if you, if you feel inclined, just come check me out. You know, I'm over there. We're we're chilling. <laughs> you can uh, you can just see all my videos whenever they're posted, I guess. I, I guess that's, like, the big advantage of it. I don't know. Is that an advantage? I, I guess you get it in your sub feed, so, I mean, there's that. Uh, what do we want to do here? Uh, we gotta do, like, every three and two and a half minutes. Let's do this. Sorry I'm not talking about these stages much. I don't really have much to say about them. Um, they are what they are. <laughs> I mean, that's, that's kind of what I got. Uh, they're not really difficult for me. That's why a lot of the times I ask you guys for your feedback. Just because for me, it's like, okay, you know, I'm hopping in here, but uh, it's not, like, super crazy for me or anything. So I am curious about how things are going for you guys. And, you know, the more I know, the, uh, the better prepared I can be in my commentary on future things. So, like, I know I, I had no issues with the um, Hercule and Bobbity Easy A areas. And, I mean, those videos blew up because it seems like several people were having issues with those. So, not to, like, say if you're having issues with those, you're bad or anything, but... You know, it's just like one of those things where I'm a little bit disconnected these days um, from like how the community is feeling about a lot of events now. So, I mean, it is what it is, but um, let's see. Oh, I kind of, I think I messed up one of these. Let's see, 315, seven and a half. Let's see, this one should be, oh, it is 1045. And then, yeah, no, 14, that's, no, what did I mess up on here? 315 to 730. 1045. That doesn't seem right. Hang on one second. I, I'm, I'm messing with something. <laughs> okay, sorry about that. I was a little distracted trying to get that uh, trying to get that video up. Nice. We have this guy on rotation so we know where the super attack is. How's his defense looking? Um, How much does this guy do on his normals? 240. So we might take a little bit of damage here, but uh, we'll, we'll, we will risk it, you know. Nothing in life was ever gained by playing this game super safe, so let's do that. We won't transform, we'll just keep him stacking. I mean, there's no reason not to transform him, but, you know, it's like, if I don't have to, I don't need to, right? He may take, I don't know, uh, I don't know, 80k, 90k, maybe a little bit less on, uh, from this guy's normals, because this guy does, like, 240k on his normals. Also, he's super attacking, so he's going to do a little bit more, I don't know, 240,000, three. Yeah, I mean, we'll be at, like, I don't know. Uh, 
Uh, maybe somewhere between 30 and 60,000 damage on normals from that Piccolo at the end, but we'll be fine. I'm not worried about it. This guy's gonna be, yeah, 152, because he's guarding. I mean, that's assuming that this guy doesn't, like, quadruple crit and get this guy out of here. <laughs> so, yeah, let me know what teams you guys are bringing into these events. Um, I'm trying to do different teams in all of these just to kind of, I don't know, use different teams. I feel like throughout a lot of the 8th anniversary, I was just using, like, the same two teams over and over and over and over again. So this was a nice, you know, breather to be able to hop into these events. You know, they're, they're not, I mean, they are on red zone level a little bit, but they are a little bit easier than red zone. Uh, a few of them. So it's been nice to hop in here and just, uh, you know, chill out a little bit. <laughs> you know, sometimes just doing red zone content over and over and over where you got to bring like these really top tier units constantly can be a little bit annoying. So being able to come in here and use some like different team builds and be able to use some characters that I don't run as much has been, you know, pretty nice. So like, you know, I even used the heroes teams in, uh, in one of these videos, which was, which was really fun. So uh, things have been going well in this event so far. All right. Looks like, all right. Video is done processing. Let's post the fourth anniversary video as well. I'm just posting these all tonight. Like, I, I don't even care. Somebody's probably going to think that this is dumb. I, I don't care. We're getting these all out tonight. <laughs> um, there we go. So that's fourth anniversary. We're currently filming the fifth anniversary, so I guess I got I to gotta hurry up here. <laughs> uh, Golden Frieza should take this guy out. You know, he's going to double super. Sadly, we have to stop listening to this fun OST soon, but we will go throw the equips on Vegito and Gogeta. I'm excited. You know, uh, Broly's going to get his rematch in again. Or, I'm sorry. Gogeta's going to get his rematch in against Broly. Now that he's got these extra equips, which should help him out defensively quite a bit. There we go. Get him out of your Golden Frieza. Send this guy to the Shadow Realm. That should be all the missions done for us. Again, uh, the missions for this event are clear stage 5, clear it without using support items, and use all 5 types, which we did. So, again, all 5 types need to have an AGL, Tech, Physical, Int, S and STR character. So, uh, we have that right here. We have AGL, Tech, Int, STR, and Physical. So... That should be all the missions done. Let's go ahead and grab all of our equips. Let's go ahead and mute the copyrighted song and get the lo-fi beats back on. Here we go. Bronze, silver, gold, bronze, silver, gold, and eight stones. Just like we said, let's go ahead and throw these on the character. You know, uh, some of these characters we're losing some decent equips on, but it's okay. You know, like I, I'd rather have the defense on most of these characters. This is kind of dumb. Um, I, I don't really like putting the crit on this guy here. But uh, I will probably adjust one of his extra crit nodes to be an additional now. Um, so let's do that. You know, we see we lose an additional there. But like one of these, let's see, there we go. Dodge, additional. That's all good. Um, right here. No, no, no. That's dodge. We leave that one. Wait, which one? What am I thinking about here? Hang on. Uh, he has an extra. He, what? Where's the extra cr Oh, it's this one. Oh, is this dodge an additional? No, this is a crit. Uh, am I just going insane? I, I guess this is a good build. Dang, I would like to give him more additional, but I guess I can't. Yeah, I mean, this is... Ma okay, yeah, I have 15 additional in him already, because there's the three. Okay, so this is max... I mean, this is fine. This seems like a ton of crit, though. So can this be a dodge? Yeah, let's, let's switch this to an extra dodge. There's no reason to have this much crit on this guy. And then... Okay, there we go. Now that's good. Now let's throw his gold on him. You know, we're, we're reworking some of these builds a little bit, and uh, th this will work out well. I mean, listen, this guy's already super effective against all types. He doesn't need any extra crit. And then he's got built-in crits as well, so, I mean, there's literally no reason to give this guy any crit at all. Um, but he does have five built-in here, so... You know, we'll take the six from the Hidden Potential system, and then we've got the extra um, six from here, which is not really doing anything for us. That's where some of these equips, they didn't really put much thought into the character. You know, like, this guy does not need crit. Why would you give him more crit here? This is, like, very nichely are you going to get use out of this, but, I mean, I guess. Sure, whatever. Uh, let's find Gogeta, or Vegito. We are already on Gogeta. All right, here we go. Um, this is going to be pretty much a direct upgrade for all of his equips, so that's that's really good. There's the bronze. Give him an extra 800 defense. I don't think I'll need to change anything with this guy's build. Um, this guy needs a balance of additional and crit, it, whereas Gogeta, he just needs additional, right? Because he already has a ton of built-in crits and um, super effective against all types. Uh, this, Go this Vegito, he just has the built-in attacks, um, so getting him any extra... 
um, like crit is good, and then extra additional just to proc that extra chance is pretty good, so. The, these actually work out well for him, it's just Gogeta, it's like he doesn't need the crit, you know, why, why would I give him more crit? Um, oh, we were there, hang on, there it is, alright, there's the extra additional. So now we're at 12, 23, and 3, this is pretty, pretty good, so... Uh, pretty happy with this build on him. I don't think there's anything I would really change up. Uh, I think this is good. Maybe um, No, this is good. I I, I like this yeah. 12 23 this gives them a 46% chance to crit You know people don't like three dodge on these guys, but you know it is what it is There's gonna be occasions at some point. This is going to come in handy. I don't know when but uh, eventually it will. So thank you guys so much for watching. That is stage five of this event. You know, these videos are gradually getting a little bit longer. <laughs> uh, but it is what it is. We're going to be hopping into stage six next. So be on the lookout for that. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I'm going to catch you guys next time.